Hey guys, it's James and I. We're here at Emerald City Guitars. We're doing a pick of the day today. And my pick today was, this is one of my all time favorite guitars ever. It's a 1956 Gretsch Duo Jet. Now this beauty's in the original black finish. And it is all original with the exception of one thing I'm gonna talk about here in just a second. A little uh, insight into the Gretsch Duo Jet. Gretsch was a little bit late into the solid body game. As you can see here, this definitely looks a little bit like a Les Paul, um, but it is a chambered body. It still would be safe to categorize this guitar as a solid body guitar. Uh, the Gretsch Duo Jet came out in 1953, and between 1953 to 1957, I believe, these guitars came equipped with D. Armand Dynasonic pickups and then after that went into the Filtertrons. But these are some of my all-time favorite pickups ever, and you'll hear why in just a second. A couple more details about the Gretsch Duo Jet. It is a mahogany body with mahogany neck, a beautiful Brazilian rosewood fingerboard with the block pearl inlays. Now this guitar, as I was saying, has one thing that's not original to it, and it's actually this 1960s Bigsby. It's hard to say exactly how long this Bigsby's been on this guitar, but based on the print, it's been on there for quite a number of years. And this guitar also has the original Melita bridge, the original wiring, knobs, and everything. The original tuners. Now the wonderful thing about the Duojet is, as I said before, it's chambered, so it's nice and light. This guitar weighs in at seven pounds, 14 ounces. The neck is uh, a nice 50s profile Pretty chunky for a Gretsch. And as I said before, these are some of my all-time favorite guitars for a number of reasons. They're light, they look really cool in this black finish. The playability is outstanding, the pickups are amazing. Uh, this particular one also comes with the original Gretsch hard case. And uh, in just a second, we're gonna have our friend Brantley run this guitar through an incredible vintage Vox amp. This Vox amp is from 1963 and it is a AC30 with the factory top boost. And basically what the top boost is, it is an added gain stage in the Brilliant channel. And if you can see here on the back of this cabinet, there is actually controls for the treble and the bass. And it basically, and basically what that means is this amp does great with higher gain playing. Now this amp comes with two 12 inch non-original, but era correct from 1967 Vox speakers that sound awesome. This thing is incredible, a really great sound between this guitar and this amplifier. And up next, we're gonna have our friend Brantley take it away and show you what they both sound like. <laughs> Thank you. 
All right, guys, there you have it. It's a 1956 Gretsch Duojet ran through a 1963 Vox AC30 with the factory top boost. Hope you enjoyed, we'll see you next time.